Now we ask for your nominations for the remarkable women in your lives and dozens of entries poured in. So over the next four weeks, we will be highlighting all of the finalists now and then reveal the Coin 6 Remarkable Woman for 2020. First up tonight, Terry Geyer Brindell. At the beginning of the year, a new Oregon law went into effect banning plastic shopping bags. But Terry's plan to help the environment was already ahead of the curve. Five years ago, Terry Geyer Brindell moved to Oregon and never looked back. I moved here and I just went, wow. <laughs> she praises the progressive environmental laws and even helped pass one last year. We got the uh, plastic bags banned in Milwaukee because we have a wonderful mayor and city council. And um, then we started making the grocery bags to replace the, the plastic bags. And, you know, it just keeps going. <laughs> Terry then started a so-called sewing club to make cloth bags instead. No experience necessary. I told Dan he was going to come. He didn't have it a choice. <laughs> it's been a lot of fun. And yeah, he didn't even know how to sew. Yeah. They've finished about 2,000 bags to give away at farmers markets, community gardens, and schools. I just have an idea and I tell somebody and they go, oh yeah, let's go do that. And so it, it takes off. It's amazing. The retired teacher didn't stop there. She now collects styrofoam that would otherwise end up in a landfill. In just a few weeks, people have dropped off enough styrofoam to fill six bags. Terry uses grants she got to rent a U-Haul to transport it to Agilix, a local company that was the first to develop a way to recycle styrofoam. All you have to do is find the right people with a little bit of knowledge about what to do to get it done. Terry, though, is nowhere near done when it comes to protecting the environment. Now we've posted information about that styrofoam drop off site if you're interested on coin.com. We all know how that can pile up when you get new things at home. You can also see a story that we've done on how that local company in fact recycles it. As for Terry, she says she is always looking for sewing volunteers. She can teach you and you will find a link to her group as well. Now look for our, our other uh, Remarkable Women next week, and then we will eventually reveal the woman who wins a trip to New York City to the Mel Robbins Show on March 6th. Great.